A South Bakersfield house party turned violent early Saturday morning when police suspect two guests who were ejected from the party came back with guns, injuring 14 people and riddling Stevens Drive with bullets. Those suspects are still on the loose. The early morning shootout marks the worst in the city this year as the toll rises to at least 50 shootings in the Bakersfield area since April 1st. No fewer than two dozen people have died as a result, topping last year's total of 15 gunfire involved homicides across Bakersfield. Walter Vidas lives on Stevens Drive. He says he saw kids as young as 13 years old riddled with bullets running to escape the two gun-wielding teenagers and a third who police suspect were tossed from the house party and came back for revenge. Running, you know, young teenagers that's running everywhere. Mm -hmm. no. Was a kid was shot in the leg. Was over there in the corner he tried to go to my backyard. But was shot in the leg. So another teenager right there was a girl. It was a female. But was 16 years old. Was shot in the shoulder. And then people started screaming, you know, like they try like run, looking for brothers, cousins, you know. But it was crazy. It was crazy because there was a lot of people in the house. It was a big party right there. At least one of the victims, the owner of the home where the shooting first broke out, has returned from the hospital. Sheriff officers say he was shot in the top part over here, between his eyes and his ear. So, but right now he's uh, he's out from the hospital, and uh, he's he's fine. Fred Lancaster was just yards away when the firing began, just before one o'clock Saturday morning. Awesome! We heard the gunfire, bam, 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 real, real fast, a lot of it and stuff. And then so I walked outside, and there's a bunch of people down there screaming and yelling in front of the house where the gunshot was, was aimed at, I guess. Although sheriff's officials said the victims appeared to be random targets, Vida has said that assailants chased some party goers down the street as they fired shots. Police pulled at least one stray bullet from the passenger side of Cecilia Noriega's Toyota Scion, which took fire while parked in her driveway about a block from the house party. They started following somebody They went to this direction right here, because you saw right there, there's two bullets in the truck, and the one in the garage door right there, and another neighbor say, it's a bullet in his apartment over there, all the way in the corner. So probably they was, you know, they was uh, found to somebody, you know.